So hey guys, what's up? Here is Kali Kali. And today I'm gonna be teaching you the basic knowledge about value graph and After Effects. Graph is used to control the velocity or the rate at which your effect is taking place. It can be used for everything related with change in value like scale, rotation, time remap, position, etc. or whenever you animate anything. But in position, you need to separate the x and y dimensions or you won't be able to use the value graph. In this clip, I animated the scale to make a zoom and transition. Before editing the graph, you always need to easy ease the keyframe by selecting them and pressing F9. The graph you see here is a value time graph. Now for the transition, I need the animation to go from slow to fast. This will be the resulting graph. Now understand, when this line goes upwards, the value changes quickly and animation becomes fast. Whereas when it covers the distance horizontally and the change in value is less during more time interval, the animation becomes slow. The more you stretch, the faster will transition become. Similarly, this is fast to slow graph which is used in second clip of transition. And this is fast slow fast graph which is used in P2B transition. You can watch my timing map tutorial to better understand the B2B concept. Why not use speed graph? We do use speed graph but only in camera movements and some stuff because there it gives smoothness to the animation. Moreover value graph is better because in it we have complete control over the rate of animation or effect. Let's look at the transition here. I stretched the speed graph as far as I could but when we go to the value graph we see the extent of speed graph. But when we use value graph, we can make it even faster and we get a complete control over the animation at each and every frame. Now that's it for this tutorial. If you have any tutorial request or any idea for the content then you can comment it down below. Check out my other tutorials and enemies. If this video helps you then make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. Stay home, stay safe, see you in the next video, Neko signing out.